Hello everyone, holy crap, I've been putting this off, there's so much stuff, it's the end of the day right now, so I'm probably even going to end up filming this in two parts, I'll put it all in this video, but I just mean like, you might see a bit of an outfit and makeup change halfway through, because there's just so many packages, I'm very excited to get through this, um, and tidy up my room, because as you can see, it's created quite the mess behind me, as always, my next video will be a full face of trying new makeup, so keep an eye out for my next video. First of all, we have a benefit package. On the front it says Mrs. Shannon Kennard. <laughs> I love that. And inside it says new, the Pore Professional Super Setter. So it's a new setting spray. Pore Blurring Makeup Setting Spray for 16 hour wear. Alcohol free, waterproof, sweat proof, and smudge proof. By the way, I will put a link down below to this makeup if it's up already. Um, also, they've given me a journal and some really cute pens from Kiki K and the professional setting spray. So I'll definitely try this out in a video. I don't really like the primer, but a setting spray might be a whole different story. So it'd be cool. Cool to try. Next up, we have new Huda Beauty and I'm so excited for this because I'm going to 100% do a lip swatch video. I literally read a comment today. This just arrived in the mail late this afternoon and I was reading a comment earlier today of someone asking me to swatch the new colors of the um, lipsticks, Power Bullet Cream Glow Cream Lipsticks, so I'll definitely do that. I've already filmed one um, Huda Beauty lip swatch video in the past and love the lipsticks. They're definitely really good and there's also all of these new lip pencils, so if you guys want me to swatch the lip pencils in the video as well, let me know, otherwise I'll just do the lipsticks, but yeah, they've sent tons. I don't know if this is all the shades or not, but there's a lot. Next up, I've just grabbed, I'm just grabbing all of these randomly, but I've just grabbed this Laura Mercier package. It's a little note on the front. Whoever writes these, honestly, like the handwriting is unreal. It sounds like it's just like a whole lot of their bestsellers. I suppose you can get them at Mecca. Packaging is stunning. We have this little sponge. It's a very interesting looking little guy. It's like a little cut up one almost. Pure canvas power primer, silicone free, supercharged essence. Ooh, I'm excited to try this. Look at that. Looks cool. I'll leave it in the box too, so in my first impressions I can actually read what it's got in it in case you guys are interested in the ingredients. I'm pretty sure I just decluttered this foundation. I think I did like it, but Flawless Fusion Ultra Long Wear Concealer. It's like this. And another primer in Illuminating which is definitely up in my alley. One of my favorite jewelry boutiques has sent me another package. I actually think there's another couple. Um, this is Time on a Boutique and this necklace I'm wearing today. I think the earrings are Miss Lola, but I think this is Time on a Boutique. And I wear her earrings all the time. So enjoy some of our new collection, Shannon. Hope you are well, Team Timer. Very nice. Cute little send out. I love the aesthetic of this brand. It's like, oh my god, there's a bird that's like flying against my window. There must be bugs. Is he okay? Ooh, 90s collection. I am a 90s baby. How many of you guys are 90s babies? Comment below. I'm a 92, which I feel like is a great year because like I was young during the 90s, but also like still remember it, if you know what I mean. Got to experience like heaps of the um, up and coming technology and stuff like that. We've got jelly shoes, you know, we got all the good stuff at the $2 shop. <laughs> they are so gorgeous. I need to do a makeup tutorial inspired by this color and like do matchy matchy. Oh my gosh, and black. Yes! Oh my gosh, I saw these on her page. Oh, I thought it was broken, but it's not. The charms just like slid off. But oh, I saw these on her page and I was like, those look dope. The matching necklace as well. And I am all about this. I love the chain with the big like rhinestone. So cute. Thank you guys so much. Let me find the other package now while we're at it. Here's another one. Okay. Congrats on your beautiful wedding, Shannon. Three boxes of goodies. So in the first one, we have, oh my gosh, the cutest little hoop earrings. They're like little half hoop earrings with like a ribbed kind of design. And this chunky chain really cool. I love it. I love it. I love it. Gives me Titanic vibes. <laughs> Ugh, and in the last one, yes, got a Hamish necklace in a 1992. Oh my gosh. I'm in love. I'm gonna wear the shit out of these. Brand new Colourpop. Millions of different Colourpop. 
packages of course we've got face wipes which i never buy face wipes because i prefer to use my exo beauty takeoff mitts or face halos or you know reusable options i just don't think there's any need for makeup wipes anymore when i get sent them i either donate them or i just use them up but i don't recommend people buy them but and some minis a mini setting spray. This is one of my favorite setting sprays of all time. It's the ha uh, little Pretty Fresh. Why was I going to say Happy Fresh? I don't know. But the Pretty Fresh and also a mini primer. These would be really good for travel. And then we have the Act Natural Defining Mascara in black and brown. I'm going to donate the black one. I'm going to keep the brown one. I've already got a jillion, trillion different black mascaras. So it'd be cool to try a brown one. Because you guys know I'm obsessed with brown right now. And I really want to try the brown lash trend as well. New Ardell beauty oh i'm so excited to try these these are like lash extensions diy ones so if you want me to try these out and do a full review like a does it work video let me know basically they're supposed to last for like multiple days which sounds really unhygienic to me because you just like glue them on yourself but who knows? It comes with lash remover too. Lasts up to six days. So yeah, let me know if you want a full review on these down below. And if enough of you guys want to see it, then I will definitely do it for you. But yeah, I'm kind of intrigued. Kind of terrified, kind of intrigued. We have another foundation for me to do a first impression on. It is the Morphe Filter Effect Soft Focus Foundation. So yeah, let me know if you want to see that too. Oh, beautiful. Stunning. Gorgeous. Flawless. Okay, so, oh, here we go. I've seen along three shades, a brush and a sponge. I'm kind of excited to try it. I've heard good things. Next up we have this really cute little bag from Makeup Geek. Including heaps of their full spectrum eyeliners. These are only like $10 each. I just can't go for them. I'll put them down below. They are really good. I really like the nude one. I've used that quite a lot. We also have some more pigments and things in here too. They look like this. They're super, super shiny. This particular one is called Firefly. It's like an orangey color. We have a box here from Revolution. Inside, Lockdown South Care, it says with a pink clay mask detoxifying mask vegan and cruelty free we get a little headband we get this lower face sheet mask calming and purifying Ooh, that could be fun to try in a video while i do my eye makeup because it just covers the bed area <laughs> this is a toning boost eye cream baku chiol I wonder what that does. Gold Hydro Gel Hydrating Eye Patches. I've got so many eye patches, so I'll probably donate these. But if you are looking for some, Revolution Skincare is very, very affordable. Mask Brush, which I already have this. It's really good, actually. Hydration Boost Cleanser with Shea Butter. A face roller. These are always handy. Indulgence Collection Mini Scented Candle Trio. Mm, not my... Not my gem. There's so many things. We've got 12.5% vitamin C, CBD oil, another vitamin C moisturizing cream, detoxifying pink clay mask, a hyaluronic acid overnight mask, charcoal purifying mask. So much stuff. Holy moly. Next up, we're going to do a couple of Clarins packages. I think Clarins is a very underrated brand, personally. In here, we have a lotion, hydrating toning lotion with aloe vera, and saffron flower extract for normal to dry skin. They also have the Mousse Gentle Renewing Cleanser. And it is anti-pollution with alpine herbs and tamarind pulp extract for all skin types. Sounds really nice. I think I'll give that a go. And then we also have a cleansing micellar water, which is very handy as well. I love just like freshening up my skin with micellar water. Or if I've not worn makeup all day, sometimes I'll use this and then just go on with a gentle cleanser afterwards because I like to double cleanse. Personally, I just think it helps to get off the sunscreen from during the day. It helps to get off any oils, pollutants, like anything like that. Okay, just a little bit more lighting now that the sun's not like directly on me. Um, this is the Double Serum Hydric and Lipidic System. I think I've tried this before it's like got a oil and then like a like a water serum in the middle it's like double wall it's really interesting you have to like pump it into your hands and really roll it together to like activate it i saw someone on tiktok raving about this she's like a model and she's like 80 and she does tiktok and instagram and stuff and it's really fascinating but she was like endorsing it she looks amazing so there you go we have some lip perfectors oh and a concealer and a foundation too looks like this looks really pretty oh i'm so excited for this package because i have run out this cleanser i used it up and i 
enjoyed it so much and I was thinking of repurchasing it regardless but Ola Henriksen has sent another one this is so good I love it like I love it love it love it love it love it one of the best ones I've tried definitely recommend it I'll link it down below for you guys so that's going straight in my shower I like to keep it in the shower for like night time or after the gym um, we also have this wrinkle blur jar I <laughs> eye gel cream why is my brain doing this to me right now it's too late in the day for this you guys I'm trying that and this is what I'm using at the moment the sea rush brightening double cream which I do really like I feel like I still do prefer slightly the um what is it the Sunday Riley is that what the brand is that one they've been raving about and I've bought like four of them and it's like a hundred and something dollars a pop this is like a good alternative it's a bit cheaper it's not as rich I would say it's a little bit more lightweight and another fat facial I love this I use this heaps leading up to my wedding and also my friend's wedding as well which I was a bridesmaid at it's so good it's got like above the surface and below the surface exfoliants in it so it just like brightens your skin like no tomorrow oh, I just hit myself in the face do I just like smudge all my makeup probably Gymshark. In here it says Shannon shake up the basics and adapt animal and adapt mal. I love these. Oh, I wear mine all the time. I've got like the light purple. This top is a size medium. I usually wear a medium. Yes it is. Um, just this fit. The f like cut of it is so flattering. It like just sits on the girls so well. And I love the animal print. I love the fabric. It's just so stretchy. Like it looks quite small but it's very stretchy. Um, yet really supportive as well. And it's got really cool like back detailings as well so thank you so much Gymshark for sending this over they've also sent matching tights by the looks of it which is super cute I love the color and also this kind of coral color which is stunning as well and the top and the bottoms the leggings while I'm here let's look at some more workout gear so this is from Stax I actually saw Lizzo wearing Stax on TikTok I was like I felt really excited because I love this brand and I was like oh my god it's an Australian company and she's wearing it. Their sizes are really really good, their materials are really good, um, the fit's really nice so I'll put my discount code for them down below. They've just sent heaps of new items. I've got like a couple other packages from Stax so you'll see some more pop up in the video. I've literally got like all of my friends including my dude mates because they do men's as well um, onto Stax. Like, Everyone in my friend group has like at least one stacks item at this point. So this is like a little vest top. Bike shorts. Oh my gosh. Yes please. This colour is everything. It's a little crop top. Sports bra kind of situation. It's like a little racer bag with mesh. Super cute. And then the more like impact type. Racer bag. A little bit more support. A little bit thicker straps. And then last but not least the full length. Uh, legging which I am so excited to wear so catch me in that at the gym I just love brown at the moment it's my favorite color right now I like to wear I just can't get enough new glow lab age renew recovery night cream cleansers this brand's really really cheap and it's really good I love their tinted moisturizer with SPF I use it so often and it just is beautiful during the day also we have here the body lotion hydrating body butter um, body bar and these new face masks hydrating face masks which I'm so keen to try as always we get a million trillion different Colourpop packages but this is the Animal Crossing one is it sold out yet probably but look how friggin cute I never got as much into Animal Crossing I was still team Stardew Valley personally Stardew Valley is the shit okay it is the shit Sally loves Animal Crossing though she's team Animal Crossing oh cute little stickies in case you're curious we've got like these little um, tint duos which is so cute the packaging is so adorable pressed powder blush in this beautiful like cool tone pinky shade this is called flower power I love the packaging it's so cute so now my camera is gonna struggle to focus because of um the lighting too and all these little pressed powder palettes I'll just open one random one and they're like this next up we have a package from Becca which didn't Becca announce that they are like completely discontinuing the brand? What the heck? They also got in touch with me right after the wedding like, oh we're glad you love our illuminating primer because it's like one of my holy grails ever and they were like, I want to send you some more and I was like, cool thank you. And then like the next day I found out they were getting discontinued and I was just like, dude, 
what the heck. These are like all of those light shifting veils, so they're supposed to just set your foundations and stuff like that um, with like a really light wash of, I guess, color and just give you a radiant kind of finish. So I don't, maybe I'll still try it, but yeah, it sounds like you won't have long to get your hands on it. And these are light shifted dewy tints. So weightless tinted moisturizers. Rest in peace, Becca. Is it Becca that's getting just imagine if it's not even Becca and I'm just talking shit. I'm pretty sure it is though, right? I can't remember. I bought some stuff off of Beauty Bay. I actually have a couple of packages. I bought um the Wet n Wild Dewy formula to try out in a video. Focus! I bought out some the ordinary um concealer and I bought these um made from plants eyebrow razors because I like to use these to shave my face but I didn't like how obviously each time I use ones like heaps of plastic and stuff these ones are supposed to be better they're made from wheat straw pp and stainless steel but yeah anyway oh and I love this stuff I currently have the one that's blue I don't know what the difference is same brand but it's like the blue packaging Saint Tropez self tan for your face so good I bought some Nabla blushes because I feel like they were discontinuing them so I like napped them up because uh, I can't get friggin the other colors that I raved about that I lost so I just stocked up but I probably won't really use them in videos because you guys can't get them now I don't think and I got some milk cosmetic stuff like heaps of new stuff I will use them in videos I have some stuff here from Ofra for Earth Day so they sent over some reusable straws oh my god cute they're yellow Ooh. they look like bamboo oh they can open and close that's really cool so you can like open them up to wash them out and then this highlighter it says it's green to pink so I'm not too sure if that's my cup of tea personally, like green highlighter. Let's have a look. Okay, it's not very green, it's very subtle. The lighting's probably gonna be impossible to show you. It's like a subtle kind of green. It's like white with like greeny pinky shift. So it's not actually ugly. I don't know, I'm, I'm unsure. But it says here, for every unit sold, they plant a tree. So that's a very cute initiative. I'm too old to sit on the ground anymore, you guys. My limbs are aching. We have more Revolution stuff. Revolution XX. Radiant Primer. Dewy Fixing Mist. I'm sorry, but these literally sound like my dream products. Gloss Stick Translucent Highlighter in Climax. Glass Gloss Highlight. I don't know, these sound really intriguing, so let's try them. More Benefit. I was sent this so long ago and I feel guilty. There's heaps of stuff in here. Um, do not open until the 19th of the second. Well, I think we're safe. It's their new mascara, I already know it is because I saw everyone else opening it on social media. But yeah, it's the Their Real Magnet Mascara, which I'll obviously try because I love Benefit mascaras. What do you reckon this is? Anyone have any ideas? I'm not too sure. Cute clip. Oh, I love it. A little stress ball. Why not? <laughs> I guess. Bottle of Moet. A lanyard. I guess this was for like a PR event of some kind. And a stapler. Oh my gosh, I'm going to give this Texo Beauty because it's like our colour. More Laura Mercier. Oh, it's their new secret camouflage concealers. I was going to buy some of this because I was um, shopping on, I think, Sephora or Mecca. I don't know, one of the two. Ooh, bougie. Look at this makeup bag. That's beautiful. Oh my god, does it actually... Oh, look. You can put jewellery and stuff in there. And then we have some concealer. So yeah, I'll, I'll definitely be trying that. Next we have this highlighter by Steph Toms. She's so beautiful. This is the Milk and Cookies highlighter. $35. It's launched already. So go check it out, guys. Okay, now I know why Louis was hanging around this package. Because it looks like there is a cookie of some kind. <laughs> Which I probably shouldn't eat. Because I have no idea how long ago this parcel was sent. But I'll show you the highlighter. Oh, it looks so pretty. Stunning. Oh my gosh. I love both of those tones. Or you could mix them together. We have new Mecca Max lipsticks in here. Let me know if you want to see some kind of like lip swatch video. 36 shades. $20. Really good price point. Heaps of different ones. Look at that. They launched 30th of March. So yeah, they're out. They're vegan and cruelty free. Wait, what? More Laura Mercier? Ooh, look at this. It folds out. It's really cute. These are blushes. Yes. Gosh, this color. Yes. 
give it to me. This is called Bellini. I've seen a few. Here is Guava. This one actually looks probably too pale, right? I feel like it's too pale for me. And I've also seen some lip pencils and these lip glaze. They must be like a lip gloss. Lip glosses too. And a brush. How exciting. All right, take two tomorrow. Hello, everyone. I did my makeup to match my earrings set. It actually looked way better. I've had it on for like six hours now because I've just been doing some editing and things. But we are here again in the afternoon doing a bit more unboxing. So first off, we have this package right here from MAC. Hi, Lily. What's your butt? So this is Dish and we hope you love the products. Oh my gosh, is this? I did a thing and asked Mac for some top-ups of some lip colors because um, I want to do a video trying these like iconic lip combinations because there's this girl on TikTok and Instagram who I love. She's amazing. She does these like iconic AF lip combinations and I'm like, oh my God, they all look amazing, like ombre lips and stuff. So I thought it'd be a fun video to do like lip swatches, trying out these like iconic um, different colors, like color combinations, I guess. So we've got the lipsticks and the lip liners in here. I'm so excited. So stay tuned for that. There's a couple of lip swatch videos coming. I'm kind of excited. Sorry, the lighting's real shit again. I just, I don't know, I can't get it right when I'm sitting down here right now. Next we have this little bag. This is from Huda Beauty. And inside we have some of their new eyeshadow palettes, like the little chocolate brown, caramel brown, toffee brown. I'll open up toffee brown. It's actually very pretty. Look at that. We have a face mask, which is going to come in very handy because I'm traveling this week. Oh, no. That's a lie. It's like next week. Or is it the week after? I don't, I'm flying on a plane sometime soon. I don't even know. I only booked the flights last night and I really need to sort out my life. We also have something in this bag here from Walita, which is a cool, like, natural kind of organic brand. So we've got Hydrating eye gel which revives tired looking eyes with cactus. I've also seen over the facial cream, 24 hour facial cream for normal to dry skin and a hydrating facial mist. I was going to spray it now but I'm doing a full face, no not full face, just a normal first impression on the Morphe foundation today. So that'll be one of my next videos as well guys. Probably the one after the full face first impressions that you're going to see next. We have something here from Anastasia Beverly Hills. It's their new little face palette. This is the Italian summer one. I'm so keen to try that. It's been a while since we've seen new um, um, like face palettes and things. Then we have the Make It Black um, collection from Colourpop. Hopefully you can still get this. Basically 100% of the profits of this collection um, go to the Pull Out for Change Small Business Impact Fund. All of the contributions will be allocated as grants to emerging black founders and to connect these founders with mentorship. So that's really cool. And inside we have some little Super Shock eyeshadows. Yeah, black packaging. So these are pretty. There's like a copper one and a red tone. We have some lippy sticks. Cool packaging. Oh, that's a nice color. It's like a really dark berry purple. There's heaps of different items. So go check out Colourpop. I have a discount code. I'll link it below. I'm not sure if it still works or not, but it's worth a try if you can save some money. Oh, I love that color. That's nice. It's like a really warm nude, medium nude. It's called Like Magic. And then we also have some of these pressed powder palettes by Colourpop. So these are Citrus Fizz and Cream Soda. I'll just open one of them and show you. They're so cute. They look like this. Just little quad eyeshadow sets. So yeah, they come in a few different color schemes. Also have some Feather Effects Styling Wax. So I'm definitely going to try these. And also the brow pencils. So I'll probably try them in my next video. Brow brush and yeah pencils. Next up, huge stacks box. So once again, I do my discount code. So this is brand new stuff, guys. We've got some new socks. Hamish always steals my stack socks. He loves them. Um, I do have a couple of pairs still. They're like hot pink. So, you know, he didn't try to steal those ones. Hamish loves them. All right. So we have the waffle shorts. These are way too big for me. So I'll probably give those to Hamish. I don't know if they were intended for Hamish or not. They're unisex. So maybe they were intended for Hamish. But they have a really nice fabric. Look at this. It's like a waffle, like real soft kind of cotton. I don't think I'm going to be able to show you. Can I like bump up the exposure? There we go. Looks like that. And then also the hoodie thing. Oh, I love the originals like logo. That looks really nice and clean. And then we have, oh, that's nice. This is the brown color. These are way too big for me. Are these? I don't know. 
Well, that is like oversized. Like, I don't know, maybe it's cute, like on oversized. But sometimes t shirts, if they're too oversized on me, I just like look really squashed because I've got a very short torso. So, you know. And then we have this color, this like oatmeal kind of vibe. And then, of course, we also have the black staple black. Ella girl, hey, hey, vacay. These are new eyeshadow palettes. They look like this on the inside. I'll just show you one of them. So looks like this. And then those colors are gorgeous. Forest tones and orangey tones. I got sent tons of new GHD products. They've got this curly every, every curly ever after curl hold spray. So you spray it into your hair and curl it. It's supposed to hold better. And then we've got this Body Goals Mousse, which I'm kind of keen to try. We've got a straightening spray. We've got heat protectant spray. I love the GHD one. I use it all the time. New White Fox Active Workout Gear. So this is their new Seamless Collection, which looks so luxe. It reminds me of Stacks, kind of, like the fabric feeling. The waistband feels really nice and secure, like tighter than the actual part where your thighs and bum goes. So that sounds really promising because it'll keep you nice and supported around the waist and stomach, yet it'll fit the booty. So yeah, the color is stunning. I got that color, and they've also sent over this really pretty blue kind of color, which I think will be lovely. And then this like kind of pale, what is this, like oatmeal-y borderline green tinge? I don't know. And I'm pretty sure this next um, box they sent close to my wedding, but I think it was for like Valentine's Day or something, but hey, lots of this stuff still online and stock on the website. So here is a beautiful red slip dress, a very sexy, the fabric just like glows, look at it. And also this skirt, which I'm kind of excited to try on. And then a matching top, it's like strappy, um, I don't really know how it works, but yep. Or oh, there's the red top, very romantic, like crop, it's like a let stretchy um, one shoulder ribbed style dress which is very flattering more cookies which I don't think I should eat cute little crops I love these this is like a lavender one I wear these a lot a pink one and a new white one which is so pretty I love this is a new skincare brand called PSA PSA isn't just our name it's our mission we're a skincare brand driven by purpose every ingredient and product has a purpose to deliver your healthiest skin ever and it's just psaskin.com and it came in this little like bum bag which is kind of cool for like festivals and stuff and inside we have this heroin hero her, that's surely not how you, shannon oh my god i feel really dumb right now anyway it's a brightening treatment toner mandelic and lactic acid why is my brain glitching licorice root kombucha pomegranate extract and centella asiatica I don't know what that does, but it sounds really intriguing. It's supposed to reduce ben blem <laughs> reduce blemishes, refine pores, enhance glow. We've also got a multi-acid and probiotic night serum, niacinamide, tomato oil, probiotics, and 12% glycolic, lactic, pyruvic, PHA, and BHA. That sounds really nice. We have the Reset Cleanser with a Sai Manuka Honey. Ooh. Faux nails, false nails. They do the sickest um, press on and glow on nails. Look how cool. So cool. I bought more stuff from Beauty Bay. I got a foot peel because I was really intrigued. Made in Korea. It's a K-beauty. And you get one pair of these little socks. Which brand was this? OK Life. Yeah, I was really intrigued. So I'll keep you guys updated and see you know, if they do anything. And then I also got the heel patches because I really dry cracked heels all the time. I don't know why, but I do. And I also got some cream to powder foundation by Milani. It's supposed to be like a dupe for the Apple one by KVD Beauty, which I can't get my hands on. So I thought I could review that. Got a couple of colors. And I also got some other Milani um, like makeup, like these Conceal and Perfect powders, um, like highlighting bronzers. I got these NYX like TikTok lipsticks to try. Skin serum tint foundation stuff. New Milani base. Just heaps of random bits and pieces. And I have another K-Beauty video coming. I bought heaps of stuff as well as some like organizing bits. This is like a um, 
like an organizer, a drawer organizer, you just slap them together. And I thought I might use it in our bathroom. So if I do that, I will vlog it for you guys. Yeah, it's got heaps of makeup and beauty items and some like little hair rollers and bits and pieces to try out. So I'm excited. Got some new MAC goodies via Mecca. Glow Play Blush. And that's peachy. I love these guys. Love, love, love them. And also these new Glow Play Lip Balms. They've got three different colors here. Let me open up this one, which is called Sweet Treat. So it looks like a nude kind of color. I love the packaging. Look at it, it's so cool. And let's try it on. I don't know what the coverage is like, so I've got on lip liner. It's nice. Got some more Huda Beauty items. So we've got the um, brow pencils that they brought out. Medium brown, light brown, neutral blonde. So they've given me some different color options which is very lovely also the wishful face and body enzyme scrub which i might use on my body i feel like when i used this on my face last time i don't know if it's the same or different but it sounded the same um when i used it on my face last time i feel like it might have been just a little bit too intense it's got ha bha which i love witch haze which i love and charcoal i think it might just be yeah maybe they've just added the charcoal or something like that i feel like it would be lovely on your body just to like really get rid of any dead skin on your chest legs arms whatever you want to do and then i've also done these eye patches so i'm excited i'm gonna give a couple to my mama oh i'm so excited for this this is from clinique and i know what it is hi shannon hope well as well please find and close the new even better clinical serum foundation for you to try we hope you like it cutest tissue paper so yeah it is a serum foundation i just tried the bobby brown one which I quite like but I've heard amazing things about this one I think it was Sammy um Sammy Robinson talking about it it looked amazing so the packaging is really cute Loki like, it's different it's cute like feels nice to hold new P. Louise the boxes are so cute inside it is a date night palette this is the packaging it looks like a tape and then these are the colors on the inside. Stunning neutrals. There's like a really pretty red color. This is the Bite Extreme Longwear Liquid Eyeliner. Rich in passion flower and agave. The packaging's dope, so I'll definitely try that in some video. I've also got this little package from Makeup Geek. And inside we have a lash curler. And we have this extension effect mascara along with these navy gum metal eyeliner duos. New Mecca. This is a brand called Moon Juice, available at Mecca. And it says it was created in Venice, California in 2011. Hydrating, serum clean, active and potent. This is hyaluronic acid and PGA peptides beets, amino acids, silver air mushroom for hydration, heaps of different things. That's what the packaging looks like, so I've never seen this brand before. Ooh, I really like the packaging, it's in a frosted glass with a pump. And then there is this acid potion resurfacing exfoliator, and it says it is 25% AHA and BHA, that's quite high. Holy moly, looks like this. Oh, I've got cramp in my leg. More Colourpop. This is some kind of wild collection. Can't be tamed. Um, it comes with blushes and super shock shadows and lip products. But I'll show you the um, eyeshadow palette. This video is long enough. Colourpop's just got like jillions of different um, <laughs> collections. It's really nice. Deep neutrals. Smoky. All good for deeper skin tones. Curious about the blushes. I just want such a blush buzz. Yeah, deeper skin tone would be perfect for this. It is called Trippin, and then this is called Jet Set. This would be more of a bronzer for me. And then we have these liquid eyeliners by LA Girl as well. More lash curlers, liquid eyeliner. And this Jet Set Mascara Lash and Glow Smudge Flake and Tear Resistant. Okay, one more because I'm excited. I already bought this, but they sent it to me as well. Um, I saw it was online on... I can't even remember which website, like some pharmacy online. I was like, mint, purchase. It's on Beauty Bliss as well. Um, but hey, they sent me some, so I'm going to try this. And I might do a TikTok on it too, because it's TikTok famous. So it looks like it's meant to just be amazing and give you like the longest lashes in the entire world. So I'm very excited. Okay, I've got like four more minutes of sunlight, so let's just... Do this last one. Rise and Shine PR are now representing the iconic leading fragrance house, Glass House Fragrances, which is Mine and Hamish's, well, one of our favorite candle bl ugh, candle brands. This parcel smells incredible. Mm -hmm. Yes, 
This is Hamish's favorite scent in the world. Ask him what his favorite candle is, he will tell you. It is this one right here. It's vanilla and caramel. And I think it's called Taha. It's like the, yeah, Taha affair. It's the um, iconic like Peter Alexander smell. You know that one? You can get these at Peter Alexander and I think Farmers as well. Oh my god, it's so good. It smells like freaking caramel pudding. The best candle ever. I always buy these candles for gifts as well. This is Kyoto in Bloom. It's Camellia and Lotus. I don't know if I've smelled this one before. Mmm, that's actually lovely. It's so fresh and like zingy and like uplifting. I really like that. I know Hamish won't like it as much because he's straight up just like sugar candles. Like he loves like vanilla or sugar or sweet like donuts and lollies and cupcake kind of smells. This is like a perfume to me. Like, like if this was a perfume I would wear it. It smells amazing. I was going to give it to a gift to my mum or something because she's coming to visit this weekend. But now I'm like, do I keep this for myself? Oh my gosh, it's so good. Packaging is low-key to die for as well. Like I love this colour. I live for this colour. It's so Vibe. This is from here plus oh my gosh, there's another thing in the glass house Saffron and rose perfume wait is this for like body or is this for like house it smells really good Okay, here plus sent me the newest Olaplex. So I'm gonna try this full show It is the number zero and it is the bond building hair treatment at home and it says Apply to dry hair, saturate root to tip, leave on for 10 minutes, do not rinse. Apply a generous amount of number three and wait 10 minutes. And then shampoo and condition as usual. So yeah, I might try this next time I wash my hair. I've been using number three for ages. And we have a package here from She Sells Co. That's how it looks. I hope you love your jewels. And look how cute the packaging is. Like how cute. Oh my gosh, the cutest little like jewelry. <gasps> Oh my gosh, I'm gonna put these in my second hole. <laughs> second hole, <laughs> like on my ears, clearly. Oh my God, Shannon. And also like, look how awesome these ones are. They're like, oh my God, it's so hard to show you. Like thick um, rectangular ones and these really cute little, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to show you. Really cute little ones that you could put in your second hole or like up in your helix or something like that. Oh, these little pearl babies. Oh my God, nah, those are, insanely cute by the way look I'm wearing those ones from time on a today okay this is definitely gonna be another favorite brand another little pair of little like rectangular overly kind of vibe ones oh my god these are me like I'm sold look how cute little love heart ring uh hoops rings <laughs> little lightning bolt little tiny little earrings and then these cool um chain hoops Love. Thank you so much. These are so up my alley. I'm gonna wear the shit out of them. Hello, we're back for part three. And so many more packages of come once again. This video is already like an hour long, so I'm sorry. I'm gonna try and keep this concise. I bought some stuff from White Fox Boutique and then also got sent another giant package from White Fox Boutique. So oh, this top would be really cute to wear for a night out. It is like a two-piece top, so one part goes over there and then this part goes over the back like a little cardigan kind of vibe it's cropped and then it has a cute little like strappy halter vibe i don't know if you can imagine what that would look like but i don't know i love it i love the fabric so it's like very slinky low-key ribbed like i don't know just a really nice fabric it's the know the truth long sleeve crop and i'm obsessed with chocolate brown so i got this ribbed skirt it's like a midi skirt in a chocolate brown color it's so cute all right so in the stuff that they sent over there's a couple different packages cute new hats that's such a cute hat self-love club oh my god this is so cute look it's got my name on it this belongs to shannon self-love club oh my gosh this is a really cute little box well very large box i should say it's not exactly little drop everything babe there's a new club in town introducing self-love club the exclusive white fox lounge collection designed to love yourself in we already know self-love looks so good on you shan oh that's so cute okay so we have this really lovely like grayish whitish kind of oversized just sweatshirt matching shorts i vibe these these are so cute and then this kind of lightweight ribbed t-shirt vibe with the matching shorts this is a really nice color and then the kind of oatmeal color as well looks like this matching shorts and then this white this looks like a mini dress 
with self love club on it and the kind of purpley pinky mauvey tone what would you call this color i don't know and then the darker version as well which looks like this i also got a scent all of the new ColourPop stick eyeshadows i'm just gonna like open one to see what the packaging's like okay so they come like this you can see the color on the end i'm assuming and then the color on the inside they're quite small and compact this is isla vista it's a metallic i'll have to go through all the shades and just pick some out to keep and i'll definitely try some for you guys i do love a good like quick easy cream or pencil eyeshadow look just like one color blended out and done now we have a another, oh, another glass house candle yes here's to strong women may we know them may we be them may we raise them uh, Glass House has launched a limited edition Mother's Day collection in collaboration with artists Veronica and Mariana. Here's the graphic. Oh, I love that. And the box is so cute. Look at the box. Oh my gosh. That art is everything. Um, I love the colors as well. Inside. By the way, I already gave my mum the candle that I briefly mentioned before. She loves it. <laughs> I was kind of gutted. I was like, damn it. Because I was hoping she'd be like, oh no, I don't really like that. <laughs> but she loved it, so share the love, you know. Oh my gosh. The packaging. It's actually limited edition packaging as well. And what's this one called? Ode to Woman Cashmere and Wild Lavender. Mmm. I didn't think I would actually like that. It just sounded a bit random, but it actually smells quite like warm and inviting. I thought it would be very, very floral, but it does have that really like cozy, like wintry kind of vibe mm, but still like a little bit fresh and like sweet it's actually pretty good and the box is so stunning i feel like it's definitely like a mum's candle like the scent of it it's beautiful we have some new maru badescu at mecca cosmetica this is the deodorant vegan paraben free aluminium free baking soda free cruelty free do you say aluminum or aluminium we have the best of badescu which comes with their enzyme cleansing gel facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water and the seaweed night cream and drying lotion so four different items in there that's really cool i really like that drying lotion and i haven't tried the night cream i'm kind of curious to see what it's like it says it's mineral rich with bladder rack collagen allicin sodium hyaluronate oil free face cream smooth to unveil a radiant hydrated complexion come morning sounds good and we have this rose body soap too the next package is from natasha denona mini love story i just love Nat little natasha denona's uh color stories like just the colors she puts together in palettes so here's the graphic it's stunning and then here's the mini little eyeshadow palette which is so gorgeous you also get a love cheek duo and a lipstick this is so beautiful cream blush and a highlighter look at this that is calling my name oh my gosh i love the look of that and the packaging is enough just to want it as well look how cool that is so cool and then the lipstick is called i need a nude amorosa i don't think i've tried many of her lipsticks yet look how cool flash hey louise so in this one yes okay so these are the pout bases i'm so excited so you can use these alone and create like custom colors by mixing them together you could wear them alone you could do an ombre lip like whatever you want so if you guys would like a lip swatch video let me know as well i feel like that would be a really good one and i could show you guys how you can like mix and match them as well to create like custom colors so i'm kind of excited okay this i bought because i saw a friend talking about it on instagram stories Gemma bear mua oh and she said it was amazing and it was really cheap so i picked up two because i'm planning on using this on my legs so yeah this is from beauty bliss this is the marzina simple and smooth pink clay leg mask so it's like a leg mask but also removes the hair off your legs so i thought it'd be really handy like a two-in-one so remove your hair and then treatment exfoliate and smooth it's cruelty free it's got natural clay it's made in new zealand and it has hemp seed oil harakirikiri and karuku plum um so it sounds amazing and it, you just use it for like five minutes you just paste it on and then off you go i actually bought this already i haven't used it yet but then i got it in a pr package <laughs> well i don't know if i got exactly what i bought because i bought the tanning liquid foam was it foam i don't know like the body stuff but anyway so they've sent me the new collection this is pure so it's all clear it doesn't have like a color guard so it doesn't rub off on your sheets um and it is made with recycled material cruelty free vegan it's got 
um, hyaluronic acid in it for hydration and it's supposed to just be like more natural I think I don't know anyways so in here we have the self tanning sleep mask which I suppose is for your face and then we have the face mist and self tanning okay well there you go I didn't actually buy any of these I bought the body stuff and I think I got it off farmers so these ones are for your face oh there's more there's two layers Da, 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 da. There's a mitt, gradual tanning lotion, and then the foaming self tan water, which is what I purchased. So yeah, I haven't tried it yet though. Here are the Becca um, face primers that I love that Becca sent to me, but yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the brand that is gone now. So ooh, these are new from Bite. Look how interesting this packaging is. It says Daycation Whipped Blush, clean blush, cruelty free, vegan, and gluten free. Ooh. Ooh, these look interesting. So they've sent me Melon Mojito and Hibiscus Slush. Open it. Oh, twist it. Okay. <laughs> so it looks like this. Very interesting packaging, right? I'll have to try that. Alright, so Schwarzkopf has now got a recycling program, which is awesome to see. All hair care and colour products are 100% recyclable for free. With the TerraCycle program, so use this box to collect hair care and colour waste. And I've seen heaps of stuff in here, which is so lovely. And there's an instruction guide, so it just says to sign up at terracycle.com slash Brigade. Click on the Schwarzkopf Cares Recycling Program and then you join as either a private collector or a community collection hub. So I suppose if you had like heaps of friends or whatever you could just create a community one. And then you collect it all in a box and then um, you download a free label, you stick it on the box and they, yeah, they get it. And they recycle it. And for each kilogram of used hair care color packaging you send to TerraCycle, you'll receive one dollar in TerraCycle points, which can be redeemed for a payment to a non-profit organization or school of your choice. Dope. So, if you'd like to, feel free to screenshot right now the information. They've sent me purple shampoo. They've sent me a express mousse treatment. Some cool pastel hair colors. You guys know, like they do heaps and heaps of different things. Heat protection sprays, shampoos, conditioners, aerosol products as well are recyclable, which is good because I actually have some um, that are almost ready you know, almost used up. This product right here, I love it. It's so, so good. It's a foam condition, uh, uh, conditioner, foam dry shampoo. LA Girl VIP Access. It says here, what's your vibe, VIP or main stage? And then, I don't want to break my nail. You open it up. And there is a couple of palettes and some other fun products as well. Colored eyeliners, lip glosses, heaps of stuff. You can kind of see the colours that are inside the palettes too. More Colourpop, of course, because Colourpop just loves to make makeup. I mean, so do I, but Jesus. They've got brushes. These are cute yellow brushes. Shadow stick set. I want to see the eyeshadow palette naturally because that's one of my favourite makeup products to like collect and everything. The packaging is dope. I love the packaging. It is so cute. Reminds me of like um, Italian vibes. Like where did I go? Sorrento. Um, and then on the inside... Oh, that's actually stunning. I love those colors. Very pretty. Glisten Up Illuminating Mist. Ooh, that sounds pretty. Looks like this. It's a very similar packaging to the one that I love, so I wonder what it's like compared. Yeah, there's heaps of stuff. Soul Body Shimmering Oils, Face Sticks, Blush Sticks, heaps of stuff. Gymshark. Hey Shannon, what do yours want? Wearing the correct support level for your activity means you're perfect. What? Pear. Oh, boobs. Okay. Guys, look how pretty this color is. Barbie vibes. They sent two pink ones and also this one which looks really supportive. Um, yeah, that looks dope. More stacks as well. It is the Lux Collection. It's back in two colors, black and slate. These are so cute. It's like a black and white collection. What is this? Is this like a t-shirt? Oh, it's a singlet. Like a workout singlet. New Walita Pomegranate Firming Facial Oil. Non-greasy and nourishing boost for radiant skin. Samantha March Collection with Ofra. So inside we have some goodies. So there is this lip gloss trio with three different colors. Peony, Millie, and Queen. And this um, face and eyeshadow palette, which is such a nice color kind of story as well very morvy tones we also have this i think this is a bh cosmetics collaboration bff with alondra and elsie and this is how 
Ooh, it looks on the inside. So there is two different lip duos and two, or oh, well, two palettes. So one is a face palette and one is an eyeshadow palette. So here is the eyeshadow palette. It looks like this. And there is a liquid lipstick and a sheer gloss in here. Looks like that. And another one. And then this really pretty face palette too. I purchased some more stuff of Cult Beauty. Just a couple of things that you guys have actually recommended to me. So I did my full face of Charlotte Tilbury video and you guys recommended that I also try the Flawless Filter. Apparently it's meant to be a similar product to the Auric Glow Lust. So, so keen. I also picked up her bronzer which is huge. So now I'm kind of regretting life because I hate when you get bronzers and they're gigantic like this. I don't know why. I think it's just because I can't store them nicely with all my other bronzers that are normal sized. Anyway, maybe it'll be amazing. And I also picked up this Hopscotch by Milk. It is a color chalk. So I don't know. I just thought it looked intriguing. To see how a new face tanner, my skin is like glowing. I mean this has still got color guard on so it looks a little bit funny but soft. I got the Lizzie McGuire collection. I used to love Lizzie McGuire. I'm not going to go through everything like in depth because honestly this video is getting ridiculous. But here's the palette. Cute packaging and the colors are dope. I love the colors. Those are so cute. Oh my gosh, yes. Gives me all of the like 2000s vibes. And there's like these jelly glosses <laughs> which creep me up. They remind me of ones that I used to have when I was a kid. And lip scrubs, I think, as well, which is so cute. And a couple of blushes. I'm going to open one. This is D-lish. And it is a sparkly pink colour. Soko Loco palette by uh, Natasha Denona. I don't think I've seen this one. Oh my gosh. Look at the makeup artistry. That's beautiful. I love women. You know what? We are fucking beautiful. Okay, this is the packaging. So cool. And here's the colours on the inside. Ooh. Reminds me of oh my god, did one of those eyeshadows just fell out? <gasps> it did. It fell on my carpet. I'm so upset. What the fuck? It reminds me of um Novena palettes. Like the colour scheme. I don't know. Don't know which one, but one of them. I was looking at them recently and it gives me those vibes. Oh my god, I can't believe one of those just fell out all over my carpet. What do I do? <sighs> Baby. Okay, crisis averted. I just vacuumed it up. Like didn't rub it or anything I just put the vacuum straight on top of it and it just went straight up and I'm all good there's no stains we have the new Dragon Beauty Explicit Mascara more Colourpop this is the what you gonna call them Bambi collection okay Bambi was my favorite Bambi and Sleeping Beauty were my favorite Disney movies I would cry at the star Bambi every time anyways this is the morning light uh, Pixie Puff Highlighter. We have the Luxe Gloss Trio. Cream Gel Liner Trios. And we have some pressed powder palettes. And some really cute false lashes as well. The packaging is just so cute. I want to open up the flower one. Because flower is one of my favorite characters. It looks like this. It looks a little bit shattered as well. But cute little five piece pans. Cute. Got a something something from Beauty Bay. This is the new romantic. So this is a 20 color palette. It looks like this. Stunning colors. Very pretty for a... Uh, you know, Valentine's Day or date night or whatever. And then there's these crystal eyeshadow trios, which I kind of, I'm, you know what? I'm gonna donate them because I can't be bothered trying to open them. I'm in a rush. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. This is from Ciate. I don't think I've been on their PR list before. Tons and tons of Ciate. You've seen bits and pieces of Ciate on my channel before. Ooh, dewy coconut setting mist. That literally sounds like me. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go through all of this and, um, try a whole lot of it for you there's even foundation guys look at the packaging it's so cute love so glam mascara primer heaps of different stuff highlighters liquid eyeliners oh i'm so excited i love the packaging i'm not going to be short on content <laughs> i've also got this i'm so excited to try this because i always go back and forth with retinol my favorite retinol at the moment is it's the like serum oil by Dermalogica and it's like mixed so it's not as harsh on my skin. Whereas this is supposed to be like even less harsh than any retinol products but it gives you the same effects. It's the Phyto Retinol Collection by Bare Minerals. And I got this from Mecca. So Mecca stocks this. And yeah, it's basically a clean version of retinol. Clean, vegan, quite expensive. 
but I'm really excited to see if it works well. Phytoretinol is a potent botanical extract proven to deliver the same skin transforming results as retinol. So really good for um, aging. So yeah, but it doesn't have those side effects like redness or drying or sensitivity. There's a neck cream. I'm so excited. I've wanted a neck cream because I have really wrinkly, ugly neck lines. And on my chest too, like get one here because I sleep on my front or on my side and my boobs get all squashed like this see and i just like cave into myself when i sleep because i'm like squashed and it just creates all of these lines i really need to try and start sleeping on my back but yeah heaps of stuff in here something from glam raider Ooh, i've never tried this brand before looks like this let me know if you guys have tried it before we have an aloe infused setting spray lip pencils i like the packaging they look nice the colors I love how they come in a little set like that. That's so cool. Pigment drops, heaps of different pigments. The packaging's really cool. Look at it. Very cool. And heaps of lip glosses. Peach scented brush cleaner. And we have only like four more parcels to go, guys. Unless I've got more at the front door, but I'm pretty sure that's it. We have Primer Potion and this new Wild West palette by Urban Decay Naked. Are you guys over their naked palettes or is that just me? I don't know. I guess they probably just sell the best because they have launched other palettes in different shapes as well. In saying that though, I always like them <laughs> like a lot. <laughs> but I don't know, I just don't get excited I guess when I see them. The packaging is really cool. It's like snake skin and the colors are gorgeous. Looks like that. And then we have this Ultra 3 Feel the Heat collection. I just wonder what smells so good. So this is an ultimate eyes set. Looks like this. Similar tones again, neutrals with like royal tones. These look like nail polish. Yeah, nail polishes, these really pretty like desert tone. Care and repair liquid lip masks. Those sound interesting. And they've sent some kind of cocktail. Cocktail with no name, keep refrigerated and serve chill 12%. Mango vodka, peach liqueur, passion fruit, ruby red grapefruit and lime. That sounds amazing. And then real quick, because Hamish just got home, we have another package here from Ofra. So they sent like a little spa headband. Micro Glow Daily Micro Exfoliating Cleanser. That sounds really nice. Made with polylactic acid to smooth. Um, and it helps to remove skin impurities and build up from the day, encouraging cell turnover that brightens dark spots and heals the skin. New treatment oil. And last but not least, nice and easy, um, Revolution have launched a whole lot of makeup brushes. They all look like this. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm sorry it was so long, but if you enjoy PR unboxings, it's probably like a dream, I guess. So hopefully you enjoyed it. <laughs> Bye.